Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to Recreation Runner. This is a bit of a weird one. I'm sat in the car. Um, if you're new to the channel, I upload free tips and tricks for the running community on a weekly basis. Uh, so please hit that subscribe button and the bell to receive notifications of when I upload. I haven't uploaded um, for a week. I haven't been running for two weeks. That's why. Um, because last Tuesday, so Tuesday before the one that just gone so we're now on Friday evening um, I was trying to get Sophia out of the car out of the car seat and as I bent over I pulled a muscle in my back um, I did what everyone normally does and that's just kind of put heat rub on it take pills try to give myself some a bit of massage and loosening up and stretching most days but it's progressively got worse to the point where I can't sit down um, on a normal chair even in the car I shouldn't really be recording this in the car but it's really windy outside uh, for more than about 10 minutes now without starting to get lots of lower back pain um, and then m moving myself from that position is excruciating when I wake up in the mornings when I've been laying down getting out of bed and standing up it's horrific I'm in a lot of pain so I uh, just wanted to give you an update really I've done what I should have done a week ago and that's come to see a professional tonight I've gone to a good friend Kieran who runs the Stevenage uh, sports injury prevention and rehab clinic I think I'll put a link or something below with the correct uh, title of that um, he's obviously hugely qualified he used to be the head coach of our running club as well so he's a, a running coach he's a massage therapist and a sports injury re rehabilitation therapist there's obviously a proper uh, job title for that but um, he's qualified he knows what he's talking about so he's he's loosened it up a bit i'm feeling a lot better but i definitely need to see him maybe a couple of more times and he's going to send me a rehab plan tonight as well of what exercises i need to do something i knew my glutes are weak um that's not helping but obviously sitting at a desk and driving in the car a lot um, are two things which have led to me having very weak muscles in the lower back um, he told me the names of those muscles, the, the two that were tight, that were causing the issue, um, but I can't remember them. But anyway, that's an update for this week. No running, but I am injured and uh, yeah, I've been pretty depressed with this as well, by the way. Um, it's a tough one. We've obviously got a baby, one years old. Um, Sylvia's gone back to work, that's my partner, and uh, she's having to get up at night when Sophia wakes up. She. She's not bad, Sophia, but she's been a bit sick because of nursery and stuff. So she's waking up two, three times a night. Um, and she just needs comforting, really. It's not for food or anything like that. Sometimes, obviously, she needs a nappy changed. But I literally cannot get her out of the cot unless she stood up. And I definitely can't put her back in the cot. So Sylvia's having to do all of those night duties. I'm basically useless. So I'm tired and angry and annoyed uh, being like this work has become difficult i've had to work from home um i'm just down i'm down in the dumps and sylvia is as well so all of that combined is uh is pretty stressful i just want to get back on my feet and back running basically and sylvia wants me back helping with the baby properly so she can get a good night's sleep every now and then um so it's not a good place to be so obviously i want to just keep you updated where i am and what I'm going to do to strengthen. I harped on during the, the uh, Red January Challenge about strength training. I was doing strength training, but only squats, lunges, and calf raises, as I said. I was doing push-ups as well, actually. I didn't mention that in my last video. Um, but nothing specific, really, for the back or the glutes in particular um, about... It's neural pathways making your uh, muscles fire in the right order. And I'm, my hamstrings are firing before my glutes because I've got very weak glutes. And when you're running, it should be the other way around. Your glutes should fire first, then your hamstrings. So Kieran's going to give me loads of advice on um, some things I can do to try and train my brain and my body and the neural pathways to correct that, which will help long term. So, sorry, this has probably been a bit longer than I wanted it to be. But please um, subscribe, like, hit the bell. I'll keep you posted in the next video on how we're doing. Thanks a lot. Bye. Oh, for those of you that are running, happy running.